there is anybody here, anybody at all, that has any reason that the two of these amazing, wonderful, special people should not wed today, speak now or forever hold your peace. <gasps> oh, no. This auger's ill? I can't believe this. Daddy, is that the man from? Yeah. Um, I can't believe he chose face. This can't be happening. This cannot be happening. I don't remember inviting him. Invitation or not, we won't let him ruin our wedding. How dare you? How dare you show your face today of all days? It's supposed to be joyous and happy. It's a day of celebration. What, 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 what? Did you think that you would never see this fabulous, fantastic, wonderful and cute person again? Well, I'm back. Oh, Pot Charles. Where were your manners? Doesn't anyone want to come over here and give Richard a little kiss? Hmm? Oh, yeah, I got something for you to kiss right here. Richard, Richard kiss this. Careful, Miss Go. He's, he's, he's crazy. Yeah, yeah, well, so am I crazy. Crazy would rage at you. That's it. No, Maxie. You and your tragic accessories will not be ruining my parents' wedding. Maxie. No, he's not ruining their wedding. Can't just calm down, okay? Please, for the baby. Why in the world would I want to ruin their wedding? I'll tell you why. Revenge. You want to ruin Mac and Felicia's wedding to get back at me because I ruined your whole little nurse's ball plan with that ridiculous, tawdry, gossip-mongering 80s number you were trying to pull off. Oh, yes, the 80s number. Hmm. Wait, wait, I'm getting something from my crystal ball. Heather Weber, light as a feather. 70s, insanity. Insanity is still very much in progress, actually. <laughs> wait. From my tarot cards. Oh no, Monica. Quatermain. I have a little name for Monica. The Tramp Champ. Daddy, what's a tramp? Uh, sir, I politely request that you leave quietly. <laughs> or I'll not so politely remove you loudly. Look at you two masculine men. But you know what you really are? You both are sour pusses. But wait. I have a little something here. He's got a gun. He's got a gun! Hmm. Oh. <laughs> this wedding is bananas. <laughs> We don't need the magic molly crew to get him out of here. Wait. Let's wait for all the boys. Oh. Seriously, I can wait. I have a little time on my hands. I have a little time. Wait, wait, wait a minute. Gentlemen, two What are you doing? Don't stir with him. What? What are you doing? Put me down. Explain that to the boys at Ferncliff when they're strapping you into an unsequined straitjacket in a white-on-white -white padded cell, and there will be no glitter, no little starry things, no sequins, and no... Disco! Wait a minute. No disco? Okay, everybody calm down. Mom, he crashed your wedding. Which isn't a crime. Right, Matt? Trespassing, disturbing the peace, littering. Okay, well, maybe he did commit a few misdemeanors, but he didn't ruin the wedding. He just made it more memorable. Memorable. <laughs> Fellas, put him down. Thank you. Thank you. The voice of reason. Don't push it. I don't have any cash. I can give you an IOU. <laughs> um, he's clean. Of course I'm clean. I come in peace. From what planet? You're done. We'd like to get on with our wedding. <laughs> I'm not done. I knew it. I knew there was more to this. I come to... Uh... Apologize. You so you want to apologize? For what? 
Exactly. I want to apologize for the way I acted at the nurse's ball. I was a little uh, feisty and out of my mind and a little crazy. A little crazy? You, you bit me. Well, there wasn't much to bite. You have zero body fat just about. And I went home hungry. But what you didn't know is I was uh, going through a very bad personal crisis. Is there an apology in our immediate future or just a bunch more excuses? What you all didn't know is that um, a celebrity friend, <laughs> Demi Moore, uh, asked me to go on a juice fast with her. Oh, why didn't you tell us? We could have helped you. We could have done something. We, we could have gotten you a big fat fudge brownie. <sighs> you know, I, I just wasn't myself. And when you cut my number from the nurse's ball, I just went insane. And after a much needed stay at Transitions, I feel myself again. And you felt it necessary to apologize at our wedding? Well, how could I get all these people together here at Port Charles unless it was for a murder trial? I thought this was a lot better. Okay, fine, he has a point. And now, Lucy Co. I want to say to you, I'm sorry from the bottom of my heart. And I sit here, begging you, pleading with you, to forgive me. <laughs> For the goddess of Port Charles. And uh, in my own way, I love you. Okay, I'm gonna forgive you. Okay, I, I forgive you. I, I do, I forgive you that. You do? Yes, I do, I do, I do. Hello, this is all very touching, but everybody's saying I do except for the bride and the groom. Okay, okay, everybody, guys, guys, um, go with me on this. Let's all say I do on one, two, three on the count if you forgive Richard all his trespasses. Ready? One, two, three. I, I do. do. I'm over it. And actually, you're, you're a good luck charm. You know, you were there on the happiest day of my life when Felicia agreed to marry me. Well, great timing, because he also happens to be here on what's supposed to be the other happiest day of your life, your wedding day, which is supposed to be right now. So what do we say you do this thing and marry my mom again? <laughs> yes! Come on, you guys, let's do this! Yay! Choose you, Felicia. To be my partner in life. To support and respect in success as well as in failure. To care for in sickness and in health. To nurture and to grow with. Throughout the seasons of our life together. <sighs> okay, so now by the power vested in me by the state of New York, I pronounce you husband and wife. You, you can kiss, you can kiss. Flower girl ever. <clears throat> yeah, congratulations, you two. Unfortunately, we gotta take off. She's gotta get to bed. I want to stay for cake. No, 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 no cake tonight. Come on, we gotta go to bed. Yeah, especially if we want to go stop by and say goodnight to Uncle Duke on our way home. Yeah. Can you save me some cake? <laughs> Absolutely, I will. Of course. Will. Mm -hmm. Give Duke our love, would you? Absolutely. Yeah. Congrats, buddy. All right. Good night. Bye.